I accidentally clicked that, but hey guys, <laughs> welcome back to Puppet Louder. Um, we're just gonna figure out what my what I'm gonna do on this special Sunday, I guess. We'll see what's going on. Yes, you explained that at the meeting with the big lady and the small dude and the children. Seriously, you guys fight each other every day until Sunday, which is the, the day of the Lord, I suppose. Okay, this is probably pretty important. I feel like if I run into Caesar Salad here, I would be in danger. Okay, thanks. Let's walk around. I'm ready to go. Lucky Charms, stop explaining stuff. Here we go. Do I get to pick? I get to pick. Here we go. All right. So, I just have to say that um normally I would totally go for Axel. Like the cactus guy, I love his personality and everything. I think it's just like much more appealing. Um Kiri or Kyrie or whatever, he seems like a douche. I don't <laughs> Although he apparently so there was a tie in the poll that I took and Kyrie or Lucky Charms, whatever the heck. He was probably, I think, the second most popular guy to win. And so I'm pretty happy that we did not go for him. Sorry, guys. Um, and, like, Caramel, he's, he's cool, but he's not, like, I don't know. And then I didn't even know that they would give me these two options. Like, they want me to hang out with the cat lady and with the child. Like, I don't know. Either way, <coughs> as requested i will be going after robin hood the creepy looking dude and hope i don't die so here we go oh, yeah. yeah he's probably like why the fuck are you here no i'm in love with you oh god um yeah See, now I seem like a psycho. So my friends are just sent me up to sound like a psycho. I love hanging out in the hospital. <laughs> so awkward. Can you fly? Oh, Why are you so disappointed? Oh my god! Me and Robin Hood are the same person. I'm a psycho. Thomas? <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, jump off a cliff. Yeah. That's like asking anybody, like, to do that, I don't know. Yeah. Okay, I agree with Robin Hood. The main character is kind of dumb. Oh, he's trying to do the whole thing. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. Don't like that's like that's terrible. A complete child. She's like, oh, if you jump off a cliff, you'll die. It's just like, people die if they are killed, you know? <laughs> like, holy crap. Okay. I mean, like, what? what is, where is this conversation going? This is like poor conversation choices. And like, the music is so happy in the background. I'm like, 
Have you ever- You don't know if you've seen someone kill themselves? <laughs> what? Oh. Right. <laughs> Jesus. I'm glad she has, like, the basic common sense to know. Like... Oh my god. Why would you- Why do I have to hang out with this guy? Why are you telling me where to kill myself? Oh, ugh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, Oh, that's Oh, Oh, Oh my god! Oh. Okay. I'm like afraid. This man is like not. He's like not in his right mind. Like I feel like there, there's something wrong. He wants to know what you're afraid of so he can kill you. See, this is where the, his voice acting just like randomly stops. But anyway, what scares you is. <laughs> scares me is my face. <laughs> Your face. I kind of want to say that. Oh my god, guys. Can I say that? I'm going to say it. I don't care. Your face scares me. God, this is a terrible doctor. You're gonna cause someone to have like a heart attack or something. I would scream too. Your face is scary, Jesus. Wow. Wow. Okay, you're a douche. Well, I came back from the doctor's and now we're having dinner and I'm going to ignore the fact that I talked to the doctor and he talked about corpses and their flesh and like what they look like when they die, you know, like, okay. Red brick. Who the hell? Ah, yikes. What's wrong with the shopkeep's face? Oh. Yeah, I feel like his face just looks wrong because his mouth is too big. I feel like he would look good if he didn't look ugly, which makes a lot of sense, you know? Wow, she passed up on free bread. Rip. Oh my god. Oh <laughs> Oh no. Who are you? Oh god. Too close. <coughs> um he's kinda got like tomato slice eyes. Okay. No, I'm okay. Um, I guess this outfit's okay. Well, no, it's not. What the hell is this middle shirt? And what the- why is this tight so short? Oh my god. Oh god. Okay. Oh, this is so. So? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> this is an like, easy enough name for me to remember, I think. I mean, I just recently smashed my head into the wall and then I forgot everything. 
So I moved here. Yikes. <laughs> Okay, so Fuka's just like. Right. Seems pretty nice. Oh, I just. Okay, I guess. I'm just telling the truth, and Caesar Salad came chasing after me. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, see, so has a good point. Like, I think the main character's literally dumb. I'll be more careful from now on, or is that strange? Oh no. Yeah, see, he's a good person, right? Okay. Okay, goodbye. Um. Ah, so that. Ore no koto, so san te you no, yamete krenai? Uh, okay. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. Oh, so's trying to steal my heart, you know. よかったら来週来てよ。絶対だよ。no I don't owe you anything okay well goodbye that was weird I don't really know how to feel <clears throat> all right Monday I'm just walking past the thousands of men who've killed before. She's saying good morning to no one. She's a psycho. I don't know what to do. Okay. Oh God. Okay, Caramel. How are you doing this wonderful Monday morning? Why does everyone have to touch me? Like, I don't understand. Do you rinse an orange? I've always wondered that, because it's just like, you're not eating the skin, you're just eating the inside, so you do, do you have to rinse it? I don't know. Okay. He's cutting into the fruit skin. It's oh my god. Ah, cactus. Yo, Nebosuke. Nesugoshi, you must say. He started peeling the orange and then threw. Ew! Yeah. Kueyo, Asaichi de Katekanda. Ato de Itadakimas. Yeah. Way to spray orange juice and water on his face. It's like not very nice. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> He's sitting the floor so far away. So, Janakte, Oretach no Maya no Sekina, I tell the Ronga. Nanda the son of your Joe Sango Kaka Surunda? Yet I know she didn't know Kaka Surunda, Tosendes. 
See, like, seriously, whoever made this game is just like, let's make Axel the, like, cutest person that, like, clearly, he's kind of like a cat. He's like, oh, like, get away from me. Well, maybe I'll bite, you never know. Hmm, okay. Aww. Wow, she's really understanding. <laughs> He's just staring at the wall. What if that's not what I wanted to talk about? Okay. Oh boy, I get to look around the territory. Here we go. Oh wow, that's forward. Oh, I guess like, so it's like, do you want to go with Karamia or Lucky Charms or do you want to just go with the three of them? So I'm going to pick with the three of them because I really don't want to go with just, I don't know. I, can't, I have to go for the fucking doctor guy, right? So... Okay. Okay. Uh... Whoa! <laughs> oh god! Okay, Karamiya, make him marry me, please, because I would rather not go out with the creepy doctor who talks about dead people. No, my question's more like, why do you have to bring a marriage in that sense? But okay. Okay. Oh, okay. So it's like, what if 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 it's like, to point out who- so if you're fighting over territory does that mean that you get to like chip at the bricks and like color them differently? Is it like freaking um, Splatoon where you just like pour ink all over the place? Yeah, that's true. I thought that there would be more fighting, but okay. She must be like short, right? Like, he can't just be petting her on the head. Maybe they're just really tall, because Axel's taller than Karami right here. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, salad's a problem. Salad's gonna show up and stab you. Yeah, okay. You're asking him for money? Oh no! I feel terrible! Oh my god! Dude, that's terrible! You're using your powers. Ugh. You didn't even eat the orange! You gave it to freaking Cactus over here! You threw it at his face! Right? Yeah, that's not fair. That's so sad. I would feel so terrible. Ew, that's not fair. That's so sad. I would feel so terrible. That's so sad. I would feel Okay, 
どこからでも見えるこの塔が目印だな。OK。There's a big tower in the middle. Tower looks terrible. <laughs> Oh god. Ah, Monosiri no Kirie Mosiranai, Nazo no Buttaida. Oh, a king lives in it. Tono Winio, Kono Sekai no Oga Sunde Iruto, Kitty. Nanda, then sets or singes the Naga. What is this? Yeah, you make up the Injanaga. Nandemo. この塔の最上階に住む王様に会えたやつは願い事を叶えてもらえるらしい。So my guess is that I have to reach the top of the tower to have the king grant me my wish to be with the creepy doctor man. That's my guess. だがどうすれば会えるかは不明だ。この塔に入り口はない。あるのは町を支配するファミリーの名と長方形のくぼみだけだ。OK。伝説が本当かどうかはわからないがこの塔は目印として大いに役立っている。That's kind of cool. Okay, what is with you? Stop touching me. Good God. 迷子になったとしても塔を目指して広場にたどり着きさえすれば屋敷へ戻れる。ここから見える赤いレンガ道を歩いて帰ればいいだけだからな。簡単だろ ?Okay, sure. 町の中心部にあたるこの広場はどのファミリーも支配していない共有スペースなんだ。他の領地へ赴く場合は、なるべくここを通った方がいい。人目につきやすいから、やましいことはしませんよって証明になる。That makes more sense, I suppose. ああ、もちろん。相手にもよるが、見学な中ってわけじゃないからな。Okay. 買い物したり、話をしに行ったり。まあ、俺が出向くことはめったにないけどな。当然です。あなたが動けばいろいろと勘ぐられます。ボスってその点が不便だよな。Well, um, we're gonna stop here, I suppose. We learned a lot about the tower, but I'm, I'm just so confused. <laughs> I'm just gonna try to keep going for creepy Robin Hood, and hopefully, Robin Hood will get better and not talk about corpses so much, or、uh, killing yourself, or showing me where to kill myself. And、um, yeah, we'll see how this goes. So,、uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time.